here in Silverthorne, Colorado, day one. Actually got in late last night and uh, got checked into the hotel late after a long, crazy flight. Um, we were diverted from, we were almost to Denver and we got diverted because of weather and went to Albuquerque and sat there for a couple hours, then came back to Denver, then flew around the mountains for about an hour because of the weather, I guess there were still some weather conditions and, uh, finally made it here to, uh, Silverthorne, Colorado. We're, we're heading to Glenwood Springs, Colorado and, uh, we just left our hotel and, uh, we're going to grab some coffee back here at, um, I found this place on Google. It's called House of Vibes Coffee and Cocktails. So we'll see how it is. I'm, I'm usually a Starbucks guy, but I said, let's try something different today. I'll give you a little view of the neighborhood. Across the street, you have the outlets at Silverthorn. Uh, someone had mentioned that's a nice outlet shopping center. I'm not a big shopping type person, but uh, my daughter's with me, so let's uh, let's keep that quiet. I don't want her to get too too crazy. And uh, let's go try some coffee. Let's see, House of Ives coffee and biscuits. Odds and ends, family and friends. Let's try it out. That's interesting. Good cup of coffee here at uh, also vibes in Silver. How do you say it? Silver Springs, Colorado. I think I pronounced it right. Also vibes. There's, there's the Solaris where we were going to park. So it's right next door to this. $40 for an hour. Okay, folks. First time in Bell, Colorado. Um, we came down here to the little shopping uh, area just to kind of look around. And uh, I do want to point out to you, this parking garage over here is called Solaris. It's about $20 for a half hour and $40 an hour. Very expensive. Right next to it, you have another parking garage literally right next to it. It's here compared to here. This one's $40 an hour. This one's free. Uh, I'm not sure how that works, but uh, if you visit Bell, there you go. Let's take a look around at some of the shops. Some little kid is not happy to be in Bell, Colorado. 
So we parked and our stairs are right next to the village center, center shops and restaurants or carrots, jewelry design. What a cool little town. Uh, there, there's a car. Yeah. Oh, this is a, um, looks like a hotel. Destination by Hyatt. Hey, you can get a discount in Val. 70% off. <laughs> how you doing? Good, how are you? Oh, yes. 70% off uh, a lot of bundles, probably. What is this called? Oh, I thought it was Aubrey. You want to walk in there? All right, we are searching for a public restroom and we're told that uh, there's some up here at the transportation center. There's the town of Bell. Look at the artwork over here. Pretty town. Now we are here in May, so not a lot of snow on these mountains. I'm guessing there's not much snow skiing right now. La Cantina, Mexican restaurant. We have some good prices here in Bell, Colorado for Mexican food. So here's the uh, Bell Village Welcome Center right here. And uh, this is where we parked. It looks like there's a little museum right here and we parked in P3. Welcome to Bell, town of Bell. And uh, I'm sure most of you folks that are watching already know this, but uh, Bell is a very famous snow skiing resort town here in Colorado. Um, I've driven by it several times, first time to actually stop by. Looks like this might be hotel maybe beautiful trees so here's the uh, Bell Mountain information <coughs> Mountain Hoss Gondola one. Oh, let's check out the, I believe the Colorado River. Oh, and it looks like there's a little hiking trail back here. Check it out. Russell's Bar and Restaurant, Sotheby's International Realty.
Our first time, our first time to Val. Oh, okay. Oklahoma. Oh, and I like this park. Oh, it's gorgeous. I love the everything, the mountains, the water. Yeah, that's gorgeous. That's nice. You gonna be here for much longer? A couple of days, yeah, so, yeah. So the GoPro game start next week. Oh, really? Of okay. Yeah. Well, we leave Saturday, oh, okay. so we're we're heading to Glenwood Springs for okay. a day or two. Right. So. That was very nice. Yeah. 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 I I would suspect there's not much crime in a town like this. So we were tempted to run out with the ice cream, but we saw your truck, so we. <laughs> Just teasing. <laughs> Yeah, you'd be close to Aspen too on that side. Yeah, yeah, we might we might go by Aspen. Yeah. What is your name, sir? John. John, I'm Jeremy. Nice to meet you. My daughter Aubrey. Nice to meet you. You stay safe. Take care. Thank you. In the beautiful town of Bell, Colorado. How's the food? How's the food? What kind of food? Little, little, uh, Austrian. Austrian. Very nice. Okay. Thank you. Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory. That sounds familiar. You want to buy some real estate here in Bell? Here you go, Gateway Real Estate. I'm sure there's other options too. Always watching us. They don't like it when we watch them. But they're always watching us. Village center condominiums. Those look really lovely, really beautiful.
Lots of little cafes, restaurants, shops, ice cream. Hotel. So the bus that we keep filming, that we see, it looks like it's a free bus to Vell Village, which is back this way. I thought this, I thought all of this is Vell Village. So I guess if you get tired of walking, you can jump on the bus and get back that direction to your car.